What's good, Washington fans, and great morning. Happy Sunday. Uh, this will be a quick video. Uh, the Washington football team has released Lamar Miller, a running back who used to play for the Texans. Um, Jared Patterson, man, that's all I got to say. That's why this move was made. We got five running backs right now. Um, so we'll see what happens. I mean, Peyton Bar we got we got Antonio Gibson, uh, J.D. McKissick, Peyton Barber, John Williams, and my guy Jared Patterson. Jared Patterson balled out, man. He was probably, like I said, I think he was, he, I think he had the best game out of everybody, you know, other than Chase Young. Chase Young had an incredible game. Um, both quarterbacks played well in the preseason game, but from a running back standpoint and wide receiver, he led the team in rushing and receiving yards uh, against the Patriots. Not a lot of yards because nobody really had, like, a huge play offensively, but he played well. I mean, the way he was juking guys, um, he had a stiff arm, and then the pad, the catch where he came back to the ball from Heineke, I mean, he's playing, he's making plays. I think, honestly... If it came down to, if they only wanted to keep three running backs, they better keep Jared Patterson over Peyton Barber. He just brings more to the table. He can do more. And Peyton Barber, yeah, he'll, he'll get you uh, one yard on a fourth and one. But I think Jared Patterson can do the same exact thing. And there was a third and one in the Patriots game where Peyton Barber didn't get the third and one, where we had to punt the ball, where we should have really went for it. But um, he just does more, and he's, he, and he's more capable of catching the ball out of the backfield. The guy didn't get 409 yards in a college game for no reason. Like, the guy can play eight touchdowns in one game, eight tubs. And he's from uh, D.C. He's from PG County. Went to Pilates High School. So the storyline is there. Best buddies with Chase Young, too. So the guy can play. All that aside, even if he was from California, the guy could play. Just like, you know, Darren Sproles played for the Chargers with Ron Rivera as the assistant coach. I get the comparisons to Darren Sproles and Maurice Jones-Drew. I see it. I think he can be an, another undrafted gem for the Washington football team. I think this guy can play. And... um He's got that burst and that explosiveness, so I, I, I'm I'm in the Jared Patterson fan club. Um, this is a good move. No knock on Lamar Miller because Lamar Miller played well. He caught a touchdown pass in the game from Steven Montez, so it's not like Lamar Miller is a bum or anything like that. But you know, iron sharp is iron, and this guy Jared Patterson can play. Man, he better make this roster. I got him making this roster, it, even if we keep four. I think Jared Patterson forced their hand on this one, and um, this is what happened. So they made an early cut, and uh, we'll see who else gets released. Maybe Tamaric Hemingway gets released. We'll see if that happens. They, they probably will just keep him and see how he does in game number two. But that's probably my prediction for the next early cut um, before the 53, before they have to make cuts for the 53-man roster. Um, so we'll see who else they cut. But um, happy for my man, Jerry Patterson. He, he's going to make this roster. He deserves a spot on this roster. He, if they keep it up, honestly, I don't, I don't think they really have to hide him in the next two games. But other teams are certainly watching. So if they are, if they are foolish... And end up, you know, waving him, hoping that he stays on the practice squad, which I've seen people think that, they, that the Washington football team can do. That's not possible because I was watching NFL Network and they showed like the leading rusher and the leading receiver for um, for the games because I was watching Justin Fields. Of course, Justin Fields looks good and Trey Lance. Looked, all the quarterbacks looked pretty good last uh, yesterday, which kind of hurts because, you know, everybody was like, oh, should we trade up and whatever? So it's kind of looking like uh, this 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 quarterback class is looking real. They look it is a preseason game, so I don't want to overreact from one preseason game. But these quarterbacks look like they look good. Justin Fields looked good yesterday. He did. I mean, if we would have traded up for him, I wouldn't have been mad at that, but it is what it is. Um, but to get to what I was saying, NFL Network, the little ticker at the bottom, it showed him as the leading rusher and the leading receiver. And teams see that. Teams watch film anyway. Even if that wasn't up there, they seen what this guy could do. And another team is certainly going to pick him up. So it would be it would not be wise to cut Jared Patter. He's going to be gone. He's going to be claimed. So you guys let me know what you guys think about the release. I mean, it's a pretty... Easy. I mean, I, th I think everybody 100% agree with this release. Um, but, you know, I like Lamar Miller. Like I said, no knock on him. But Jared Patterson, he just looks like he looks really good right now. So, all right, you guys, have a good uh, Sunday. Peace.